Welcome to the General Chemistry 1 class. This section is on stoichiometry focusing on percent composition of compounds. In this lesson, we will calculate the percent composition of a compound from its formulas. Always take note that percent composition of a compound is the mass in grams of the elements present for every 100 grams of the compound. For example, the percent composition of water is 11.2% of hydrogen and 88% of oxygen. This means every 100 grams of water has 11.2 grams of hydrogen and 88.8 .8 grams of oxygen. Percent composition of a compound can be determined given its chemical formula. And here are the different steps or the following steps to follow. Step number one. Calculate the molar mass of each element present. Step number two. Calculate the molar mass of the compound. Step number three. Divide the molar mass of each element by the molar mass of the compound and convert answers to percentage. Let us apply these steps to some examples. Let's have the first example. To know the percent composition of sodium chloride, let us first calculate the molar mass of each element present. The compound has one sodium and one chlorine atoms. The molar mass of sodium is 22.99 grams per mole, while for chlorine, it is 35.45 grams per mole. Next, calculate the molar mass of sodium chloride by simply adding these two molar masses, we get 58.44 grams per mole. To calculate the percent of sodium and percent of chlorine, divide the molar mass of each element by the molar mass of the compound, then multiply by 100. For sodium, we have 22.99 divided by 58.44 times 100, which is equal to 39.34%. For chlorine, percent equal, percentage equals 35.45 over 58.44 times 100, which is equal to 60.66%. To check, the sum of all percentages must be equal to 100%. In our given example, 39.34% plus 60.66% equals 100, so our answers are correct. Next example is glucose. To know the percent composition of glucose, let us first calculate the molar masses of each element present. The compound has 6 carbon, 12 hydrogen, and 6 oxygen atoms. The molar mass of carbon is 6 times 12.01 grams, which is equal to 72.06 grams per mole. For hydrogen, we have 12 times 1.008 grams per mole, which is equal to 12.096 grams per mole. For oxygen, 6 times 16.00 grams per mole, which is equal to 96.00 grams per mole. Combining these molar masses, we have 
156 180.156 grams per mole or you can have 180.16 grams per mole Divide the molar mass of each element by the molar mass of the compound. To get the percent carbon, we have 72.06 over 180.16 times 100, which is equal to 40.00%. For percent of hydrogen, it is 12.096 over 180. 0.16 times 100, which is equal to 6.71%. For percent of oxygen, divide the molar mass of each element by the molar mass of the compound. To get the percent of carbon, we have 72.06 over 180.16 times 100, which is equal to 40%. For hydrogen, it is 12.096 over 180.16 times 100, which is equal to 6.71%. For percent of oxygen, it is 96 over 180.16 times 100, which is equal to 50. 3.29%. Check the answers and you will have 40% plus 6.71% plus 53.29% equals 100. To summarize, percent composition of compound is the molar mass of each element relative to the molar mass of the compound. We have our references or the bibliography for further readings. Thank you for watching.